Well, wow, did Marvel Studios kind of blow the roof off of Hall H yesterday? We got some mega Avengers updates, including confirmation on who the new directors of the project are, a rename for Kang Dynasty, and the return of Robert Downey Jr. Just not how everybody thought. Let's take a couple minutes to talk about all these new announcements, the new logos, the new names, and Doctor Doom. Well, Hall H is always full of a lot of surprises, and yesterday Marvel did not disappoint. Now, we knew Marvel Studios was coming to Hall H to break down some of their new events, and wow, did they do that. We've known for a while that Kang Dynasty was renamed to Avengers 5 and was likely to get a new subtitle. We've also heard multiple rumors about potential directors and even villains for the movie. But during yesterday's Hall H presentation, Marvel confirmed, well, everything. Now, to kick it all off, we found out Avengers 5 has been given a new title, and the new film will be called Avengers Doomsday. Now, this seems to confirm the rumor that Doctor Doom will indeed return, and we're going to get to that in a minute because that's probably the biggest news of the day. Now, Doomsday is set to be released in May of 2026, and along with the new logo that we got for Avengers Doomsday, well, Secret Wars got a new logo and a confirmation of its release date of May of 2027. So these films are going to be exactly one year apart. Now, with the Avengers coming back, there's a return of some familiar faces. First and foremost, the Russo brothers will indeed direct the next two Avengers films, meaning the pair that brought us Civil War, Infinity War, and Endgame will indeed be bringing these two films to life, and I have the utmost confidence in the directors. Now, when the Russo brothers were on stage and talked about Doomsday and the one person that would play Victor Von Doom, they said they needed, and I quote, the greatest actor in the world to play the character. We give you the one person who can play Victor Von Doom. And then one of the Dooms unmasked himself to reveal Robert Downey Jr. Now, Robert Downey Jr. made a simple statement, new mask, same task, suggesting this version of Doctor Doom will indeed be a variant, but instead of it being Victor Von Doom, I think it will actually be Tony Stark. Now, this raises a ton of questions on how all this fits in, but for me, it seems kind of obvious, especially with the end of Deadpool and Wolverine. I actually really think this Robert Downey Jr. version of Doctor Doom is going to hail from the same world as Pedro Pascal's Fantastic Four. Now, we know that Fantastic Four from their presentation will actually be called Fantastic Four First Steps, and all the news there is the subject of another video. But it feels like to me that Secret Wars is going to see an incursion event between multiple MCU worlds, and at this point, that appears to be the standard MCU, the Fox universe that was just really repopulated in Deadpool and Wolverine, and now this new Fantastic Four world, which will not only include the Fantastic Four, but very likely Victor Von Doom as the primary villain. Now, in the comics in the 2005 Secret Wars, he becomes God Doom, and basically rebuilds a reality from the fragments of other realities. And I really do think that Doomsday will see Doctor Doom actually win. He'll destroy the multiverse, he'll recreate his own world, and then one year later, just like Endgame, will return for the final showdown after the big loss. Now, now, I am excited about this, but I do have hesitations. Many mainstream fans might get pretty confused by Robert Downey Jr. being Doctor Doom. This is one heck of a bold move, and not something I would probably have done. But nevertheless, it is pretty exciting. It's some huge name recognition, and honestly, when he unmasked himself at Hall H, the whole place went bananas, so that energy hopefully carries over into a great project. Now, we still don't know which Avengers are going to be part of Doomsday or Secret Wars. All this stuff is up in the air. I full trust in the Russos, and I actually think Robert Downey Jr. can probably bring a version of Doom to life that could be pretty cool. I 100% suspect not only are we going to see the classic Doctor Doom costume, but we're very likely to see that Iron Doom costume, where in the comics, Doom took up a heroic role for a while and wore a suit of armor very similar to Iron Man, but definitely had his Latvian style built in. Obviously, this is going to be the big story for a while. There's a lot of other SDCC news coming your way about Marvel. We're going to talk about Brave New World, Thunderbolts, and the new Fantastic Four details. So hit that like and subscribe button, and we'll be bringing you some updates very soon.